Room 217? No way in hell am I ever going in here. Victoria is going to be pissed we took so long. Home sweet home, my favorite cocoon. That's the only tourist picture I let them take of me at the Space Needle. That was a good hockey game and a great fight. Man, Kristen and Fernando were so drunk hanging on the Fremont Troll. I look so pathetic. I am so addicted to this site. Look at these vintage beauties. Warren makes me laugh. It's nice to feel like I already made a real friend here. Philip Lorca de Corsha, my man. I don't think I could take my camera to those places. Look at that shot. I love Julia Cameron's Victorian vibe. Talk about analog cameras. Ah, oh, Dolly, what a fantastic eye. He could truly freeze time. Max and Chloe, best friends forever. Who even says that anymore? I'm going to have to call Chloe eventually and find out what she'll say. The longer I wait, the worse it'll be. Idiot. Cartier-Bresson, Doineau, Hamilton, the greatest. Hard to believe I'm 18 now. I'm lucky my parents enabled my photo habit into adulthood. I'm glad Kate let me borrow her copy of The October Country. I should have every Bradbury book for myself. Hmm. Oh, it feels so nice to just relax. This day has been so damn bizarre and it feels like it has gone on forever. Maybe I'll just wake up now and find out I was dreaming all of this. Or like Poe said, a dream within a dream.
I need to grab the flash drive on my desk before I see Warren. Looks like Dana left me a little post-it note. Great. Now I have to go get the flash drive from Dana's room. You can't get out now, Dana. So tell me the truth or rot in there. Welcome to the real drama queens of Blackwell. Let me out, Julia. This is so stupid. Answer, you wuss. Ugh. Hey, Juliet. Is you everything cool? Oh, yes, Max. I've locked Dana in the room because we're cool. What did she do? What didn't she do? Dana's been sexting with my boyfriend. Ouch. How did you find out? Uh, why do you care? Why are you even asking me? You never talk. Just zone out with your camera. That's why I'm talking to you now. What's my last name? Juliet Watson. Duh. I'm flattered. I didn't even think you knew my name at all. Of course I do. Just because I don't talk a lot doesn't mean I don't care. So, how did you find out about them? According to Victoria, Dana would do anything to date a quarterback. According to Victoria? Huh. She saw the sext. And Zachary won't answer his phone. Once Dana admits it, she can go. Straight to hell. Max, I swear I didn't do anything. But I bet Victoria did. I know the proof is in her room. Leave me alone, Max. Get a clue. <sighs> Hey, Juliet. Oh, yes, Max. I've locked Dana in the room because we're cool. She's your friend. Friends don't sex with their best friend's boyfriend. No, probably not. How did you find out? Uh, why do you care? Why are you even asking me? You never talk. Just zone out with your camera. That's why I'm talking to you now. What's my last name? Juliet Watson. Duh. I'm flattered. I didn't even think you knew my name at all. Of course I do. Just because I don't talk a lot doesn't mean I don't care. So, how did you find out about them? According to Victoria, Dana would do anything to date a quarterback. According to Victoria? Huh. She saw the sext. And Zachary won't answer his phone. Once Dana admits it, she can go. Straight to hell. Max, I swear I didn't do anything. But I bet Victoria did. I know the proof is in her room. Ugh. Is this a Vortex Club or a Victoria Club initiation? Truly pathetic. Juliet, Extreme Reporter. That's real nice, Victoria. And who the hell thinks I'm a hipster? Boom, this is the email I need to show Juliet. Now I have to print this fast and get the hell out of here. This better convince Juliet that Dana is innocent. Juliet, read this. Of course. I'm an asshole. I'm sorry, Dana. You are. And I hope so. You really think I'd mess around with Zachary? No. 
But I get stupid jealous. I owe you dinner. Still love me? And you do my laundry. Thanks, Max. You're like the Blackwell Ninja. Now let's see what Zack has to say about Victoria. You set me free. Thank you. Warren's flash drive is on my desk. Almost done. Get the flash drive and then I'll go see Warren. Hey, Dana. Seriously, thanks again. I can't believe Juliet locked me in my own room. Real mature. Victoria is not nice. I don't get it. She has everything. And to pull that prank on a friend? Just because they're in the Vortex Club doesn't mean they're BFFs. I'm in it, and Victoria creeps me out. Max, you're smart to be a loner here. Though Warren obviously likes hanging with you. What do you mean? Oh, nothing. When you opened the flash drive, didn't you see the special folder called Max? Yeah, okay. I gotcha. Are you blushing? <laughs> Go ahead and grab the flash drive whenever. Must protect my precious so Max never has to chase it down again. Of course a popular cheerleader like Dana would have a million friends. It's so fascinating to get a peek into Dana's social media world. And yes, Max, so terribly wrong. I better make sure everything is still in there. I think Warren forgot to hide the party buster folder. Not that I would open it no matter how tempting. I have my self-respect. <laughs> 